Golf is a game of visual beauty. From the pristinely manicured courses, to the elegance of a fluid stroke, to the precision of a perfectly red putt. But what if you played the game and couldn't see any of these things? That's what Green Valley's Dick Pomo deals with every time he steps on a course. The Wisconsin native, though, is one of the top 20 blind golfers in the country. The important thing about golf is it, it kind of reflects life. You don't change the rules for someone because they have a disability. You make a minor accommodation. One of which is Dick's wife, Sharon, is allowed to help him line up his shot as well as set his club placement. I'll make sure that he's aimed in the right direction and when uh, I believe he's all set, I'll back up and tell him to go and then he can swing. Next month, Dick Pomo heads to New York, where he'll join 14 other blind golfers at the Corcoran Cup. The Corcoran Cup is known as the Masters of Blind Golf, and it's a celebration of an organization known as Guiding Eyes for the Blind. Guiding Eyes provided Pomo with his guide dog and daily companion, Tanya. Her biggest assistance for me is traveling in the community. It gives us the same choice as you have, except you get in your car. She's my car. Dick plays in about three U.S. Blind Golf Association tournaments a year, but mostly he's just like you and me. Playing golf is simply done because we enjoy the game. It has nothing to do with the fact that we're blind. At the Haven Golf Club in Green Valley, I'm David Kelly for KOLD News 13 Now.